मेकअप कर ली कमान मेकअप अभी Baby, I love you. Go. She be acting so spoiled around teachers. She turns into like the biggest baby. She's so funny. Give, give mama a kiss. Give mama a kiss. Give mama a kiss. What you said? Ah. Give me my banana. Give me the banana. There's her bananas. This is my banana. She brought that for you. I said no. I said no. You gonna give me a kiss? Okay. I said no. I said no. Here. Chili boy. You a shit. I said no. Beso. No. Beso. No. Can I have a kiss? I said no. Please. Can I have a hug? Can I have a hug? Okay, whatever. Really, Kali? She walks better than me. You going to Mama's house or Tia's house? Tia's house. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Both houses. No. Both houses. Okay, can I come here? No. Okay, okay, okay. No. Huh? Tia's house. Oh, he said you stay in your house, mommy. I stay in my house? Mm -hmm. Well, I don't have to do it. Go put your clothes on, Sai Chai. You can wear that after, okay? You don't know? <laughs> yeah, uh huh. Put I want to go. You need a. Uh, uh... <laughs> she said, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss, Jericho. I'm in my sister's house. As you guys can see, we were we've been here chilling for the past I don't know hour or so, almost an hour, and we're about to leave. And Chai Chai wants to come to the house, so we're just getting him ready so that we can go to let the house. Today feels like one of those days that's like a movie day. So the kiddos are gonna play toys in Kalia's room. Me and Jericho are gonna probably watch a movie, right? And I'm about to go to Dollar Tree to get, like, I don't even know, like a couple snacks or something. And then maybe go to, oh. Where? To the store. To get what? 
Like That's why we're going to Dollar Tree. Yeah, what do you want? Like snacks. Because like what kind of snacks? Like chips. What kind of chips? Yeah. But what kind? What do you mean? Forget it. What like what chips do you have in mind? Like chips. You just said chips. Yeah, okay, but what kind, puppy? Like Doritos, Gatorade. Like be like specific. Um, he has the snacks. chocolate at mom's house. Yeah. The snacks. You need I'm white. not going. Hmm? Huh? You need white? Yeah, girl. When we get home, do you want to um, ask me a division question? Sure. Okay. Jericho is learning division right now. I'm not learning division. You learned already? No, I learned already. Have you guys Silas? What are you guys doing? Um, I'm learning how to... That's um, us every five no, minutes. No, no. Look at Silas, bro. What he acts like he's moving over oh, to my house. He got a whole Mickey Mouse hat. <laughs> he got his Mickey Mouse... Look at him. Mira, look, mommy. He's ready. He looks you like he's to going to Disney, Disney World. World. And, um... Thank they you. Were, they were in Silas' room, right? They came to Alina's room, and Mama was in uh, Silas' room. And how did he say in the, what does the movie and, say? And, um, we were on the phone, right? And, uh, Silas kept, uh, like, screaming, I, I want to go to the room! <laughs> to the room? Mm -hmm. Right, Silas? Silas, what toy did you decide to bring? And then Mama came, and we were like, bye, no. Woody, because Silas was <laughs> He said, not Woody. <laughs> not Woody! That's what I said. In the movie? He's going to school in September. Oh, <laughs> my so goodness. That's how he's going to be in a few months. Going. You went to school? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going, Silas? Oh my goodness! I'm flying. You flying? Get in the. Where are you going right now, Silas? Silas. He's ignoring everybody. I got my backpack. His backpack is the same size as him. <laughs> Where are you going? Seriously, no. Not in the house. Not in. He said not in that house. It's nothing. Going. Disney? He said he's going to Disney, bro. On our way to Tia's house, we go. No! We going to Tia's house. No. Yes, we are. No, I don't. Bro, look at this kid now. And Kalia crying because she wants him to come. He's having second thoughts. Let's go to Tia's house. He said, No, mom. Really, Silas? That was only like five minutes. He don't know what to do. He, I think he just wants to go to Disney. <laughs> like for real. Look at his bag, Kalia. It's in my trunk. Bag. Open. Wow. The life of a toddler. He don't want to go. He don't want to stay. No, Mama. No, Mommy. It's a go Mommy. Bye. Wow. I think he just wants us to stay. <coughs> Bye, Silas. Stay. So stay. Please, then go, bro. I'll go pick you up in a little. Come on, let's go. <laughs> He's confused. There's too many emotions. <laughs> what you said, Jericho? Oh, well, that's for nothing. <laughs> we waited there. Look, he's still trying to come. He's still at the door. Look at him. She looks like she's coming over here. She got on a jacket. Bye. Okay. okay, okay, I'll leave. What happened, Silas? As soon as I called you, you stopped crying. Look at the video I just sent it to you. And that literally was like two seconds ago, bro. Like, as soon as it was right before I called you. Let me see. You gonna talk to her or no? Tell her. Um, you don't want to tell her? You don't want to tell her? Yeah. Okay, but I'm going to hang up. Okay, bye, Silas. I'm with my booski, and we are at Dollar Tree. That rhymes. 
Ooh, Valentine's Day stuff. Do you want something, my booski? Mm -hmm. My love? Mm -hmm. Do you want some candy from here? Are you not eating lollipop candies? Oh, so Khalil will probably it's like this. Let me get her one of these. Hugs and kisses. Hmm? Hugs and kisses. It make sense. I just put some cat food for the cat and she's here. Damn, she's like, she's always around. Is she licking? Let's see, I don't know if she likes it. I don't think she likes that food. Let's see. Maybe I'll put another one in. Oh, I don't know if she, she likes it. She ate the first one already. She ate the first one. She, she's not a fan. I guess this is Now you're being picky. Now you're being picky. She's being spoiled. Or he. I don't know. But I gave them another thing of food. Like something different. Let's see if she likes it. Or he. I don't know if, what it is. It looks like a boy to me, but... You got options, girl. Which one you want? Yeah, mm, she likes the other one. Yep. So now I know what kind of food she likes. She a little spoil girl. We're watching a little movie before Jericho leaves because he's gonna go to the movie theater with Carla and her family but right now we're watching Central Intelligence with The Rock and Kevin Hart you done already? oh nice look who's here you want me to show you this? show them okay guys who gave you that? who gave that to you? Liz look <laughs> and um when you do this it's kind of like a makeup set, but not makeup. And makeup! Because we love it. What's in there? It's not makeup set. And, and we got, let me show you guys. We got one. This is white. So I stop. This is mine. You don't have to take it all out. You just tell them what it is. It's paint. What do you mean? Try this one. And that. Anyway, this is really cute. I love it. It is a chill Friday, like I mentioned. I thought we were gonna. Well, we did watch two rock movies, surprisingly. Um, we watched uh, Central Intelligence, and then we watched. We were watching Skyscraper, um, and then my sister picked up Jericho. They're gonna watch a movie. I forgot what movie it is, with Gio, Alina, Simon, and his friend. Yeah. And so yeah, okay. I'm here with the kiddos. We were just at my mom's house. We had some dinner leftovers from yesterday And yeah, oh, I I got some energy gummies because girl I have been on low energy. Why didn't my light turn on? I've been on low energy the past week um, And it's just like these B12 gummies. So I'm gonna start taking them tomorrow because the girl needs it. I just came to the room I think I'm gonna I think I'm going to attempt to read because <laughs> um, that's something that I've been wanting to do for God knows how long and right now I mean it's I was gonna say it's kind of quiet it's not really quiet the kids are here but I'm not really doing much and I don't want to turn on the TV I'm like let me try to read or something because I just want to get back to it I feel like it's good obviously for your brain and I want to try something called 75 soft on Monday I don't know if exactly if I am 100% but um, it's basically like a literally like a lifestyle change it's a challenge and let me see I, I like screenshot some of the stuff yesterday it's one of the things that um, you have to do within the 75 days is read 10 pages every single day 8,000 to 10,000 steps a day um, when you wake up in the when you wake up in the morning, try not to touch your phone for a whole hour. Also, like go to sleep at 10:30 and have your phone down by like 9:30 or something like that, and not touch your phone the last hour before you go to sleep. Um, what else? Obviously, like not eating any sugar and like processed foods, things like that. So I want to try that. And obviously, like I said, reading is like a big part of that lifestyle change. And 10 pages a day is not that bad, you know? So, but yeah, y'all. Are you guys fighting? No. Okay. 
Okay, good. Be careful with that. Do not do don't don't shoot that nerf gun. Okay. At the camera thing, I'm gonna say go and I'll shoot. You're so loud. But yeah, today's Friday. I feel like this week went by so fast. I feel like I was just in New York not that long ago. But speaking of New York, y'all, and I speak about it every time I go. And for those of you who are OGs, y'all already know. I have my moments whenever I like whenever I go to New York and I come back, I have like FOMO. <laughs> like FOMO, I don't know if that's the word necessarily, because FOMO is like fear of missing out. I I'm not missing out on anything. I just like being home. You know, like that's home to me. Um, and I just, I love it out there. And like when I come back, I'm always like kind of like obviously low on energy. But I'm just like, I feel like I thrive more over there. Like I feel like I'm me over there, if that makes any sense, you know? Like here, um, I love it and stuff like that. But this is not, like home is where the heart is, right? Like home is where my family is. But that's where I feel like I can be myself. And like, I just, I just, I just feel like I thrive over there. And I just feel so much better when i'm over there you know and i hate the fact that like what's the word like i i want to say like you only live once just do what you want to do and just go for it because it's true you only live once i don't want to look back like when i'm like in my 80s and be like damn like that's something that you always wanted to do and you never did it you know um if i make it to my 80s or you know if i make it to an older age but like you know i don't know i just really love it over there i just have these moments when i come back but i feel like once again this week went by so fast it's already Friday and I feel like I just got here. Not even lying. But yeah. Guys, get away from the floor. Also another thing is I think my baby daddy, my children's father, should be here this week. I'm hoping. Um, like officially. So that's gonna be interesting. I don't know. That's gonna be like a new chapter in, in our lives, you know? Like it's something that's definitely needed and something that we have to adjust to is gonna be different. It's gonna be different. I feel like low key we should do like a video one day. Just sitting down and talk about like co-parenting and stuff like that. And maybe do a QA. But yeah, anyways, y'all. I think I'm gonna call it an early night when it comes to like this YouTube thing. <laughs> I'm not gonna do nothing really for the rest of the day um like i said i'm probably just gonna read let me actually grab a book and this is a book that i feel like everybody has read some people like it i feel like it's gotten like mixed reviews so let's see chapter one As I sit here with one foot on either side of the ledge, looking down from 12 stories above the streets of Boston, I can't help but think about suicide. God damn, that started fast. <sighs> Not my own. I like my life enough to want to see it through. I'm more focused on other people and how they ultimately come to the decision to just end their own lives. Do they ever regret it? In the moment after letting go and the second before they make impact, there has to be a little bit of remorse in that brief free fall do they look at the ground as it rushes towards them and think well crap this was a bad idea somehow i think not i think about death a lot particularly to today considering i just 12 hours earlier gave one of the most epic eulogies the people of plethora maine have ever witnessed okay maybe it wasn't the most epic it very well could be considered the most disastrous i guess that would depend on whether you were asking my mother or me my mother who probably won't speak to me for a solid year after today don't get me wrong the eulogy i delivered wasn't profound enough to make history like the one brooke shields delivered at michael jackson's funeral or the one delivered by steve jobs sister or pat tillman's brother but it was epic in its own way anyway so i guess i'm gonna try to read this book Where's, oh, what is this? This is Kalia's camera. Here, give it to her. Okay. Anyways, y'all, I guess I'm gonna try to read this book. I feel like a lot of people have been talking about Colleen Hoover a lot the past, like, year or so. So, 
<laughs> gonna do that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate y'all. I feel like I look tired. Like I feel like I have like you could just tell right here. Thank you for, for watching though. Um tomorrow Saturday, me and my friend Liz are going to be doing our podcast episode at 10 p.m. So stay tuned for that. Have your notifications to my channel on so you guys can see whenever we're live. But I'm just letting it on over here once again. 10 p.m. tomorrow Saturday. Uh, February 3rd and yeah, I'm gonna stop blabbing like I always say surround yourself with people who truly love you and show you that They love you and show you that they want to be a part of your life and show you that you're important to them and that you are Too much of a beautiful and important person to lose. I feel like I needed to say that and also um, With people who just make you laugh and who are truly just there for you and just good vibes and good energy And you guys will see me later. I love y'all. Peace out